Researchers are asking people to put their ears to the ocean to help save the world's coral reef under growing threat from climate change, pollution, and overfishing. It's a whole sonic world that we're not aware of, so it's like really exciting to try and find out what all these sounds mean. Marine biologist Mary Shadipo and her team dove deep to capture hundreds of hours of coral sounds in marine protected areas around the globe. Google is helping scientists sift through the audio with an online platform anyone can access, which reveals what a healthy reef or a damaged one might sound like. So we've got a listening collective where you have ears from all over the world and also people listen differently. So a young person can hear higher frequencies and they might pick out a fish sound that an older person won't. All the listening is aimed at uncovering different sounds of marine life to help track illegal mining and pinpoint areas in need of revitalization. The same sound can mean a different thing if they change colour. So there's all these like nuances in the sounds that we want to know about so we understand what's happening, how they're communicating. Scientists say as more people give their ears to the project, the eyes of the world will be opened to the importance of protecting the beauty below. I'm meteorologist Caitlin McGrath, WUSA 9.